Hello everyone. I'm now introducing you the latest Western Digital Hard Drive Firmware Repair Tool from Dolphin Data Lab. Visit this web link and you can find the details and download the datasheet of this WD Firmware Repair Tool. So this latest hardware supports to work on three hard drives at the same time. Now let's enter the software program and check the latest firmware repair features. I have connected one Western Digital hard drive to the SATA one. Power on the hard drive. Okay. Start. Marvel. We can auto get detail. Click OK. OK. The the program read all the information automatically. And I'm using the USB three mode. Check my videos. Here, users can right-click and test the sele selected ID to find out which modules are good and which modules are bad. You can stop at any time. Defects. You can view the playlist here. So, if it's bad sector checking, right click, start scan, and s let's see if this drive ha has any bad sectors. So, this is one good drive. We can stop scan. We can also click stop here. Server monitoring. This one is mainly used when they are trying to run the self-test X view we can read LBA read names click OK then the hex data will be displayed here we can also read by LBA read any modules you want or you can read tracks read ROM and RAM you can view the hex data here. So here as logs. So this logs displays what you are doing. Let's check the detailed features from program. Here you can open the firmware directory directly. It's very convenient. Generated module modules you have read from the hard drives ROM yeah so it's very convenient on the common menu you will have the most common used functions soft reset, hard reset, C stop motor force loading, very powerful function this one Password, security, common repair, snow problem. Bad sector, uh, this one very useful too. Users can convert any LBA number into the physical parameters. So this LBA number is on the head one. <coughs> it's not Loaders, the loaders 11, 13, 5C, head map editing, RAM, erase vectors. Uh, this one is used for the HD refurbishing. The ROM operations, read, write, ROM, head map, module 47 generation, ROM detest, adaptive data. Uh, here, 
uh, users can edit the adaptive parameters easily. No, cancel. Uh, regenerate the ROM for L series, ROL series, and edit its DIR starting address. Uh, this one is really used to fix the bit drives. Firmware operations. Uh, users can check modules, test the head, read write, modules tracks, the whole essay, and all resources including above. Generate modules, loading the modules to RAM. Very useful functions. Set TPI CAV call zones from the essay. Create modules, then modules to fix. View GP list, G2P list, generate the P list, view T list and generate T list, SN list, smart, reset smart, disable smart, enable smart, view smart, translator, clear and generate the translator, F list, defect lock, self test. Uh, this value is mainly used for HD refurbishing, not for data recovery. It's very powerful functions for refurbishing hard drives. Self-test, single SF process. Monitor, self-test, stop monitoring. Format. Here, users can check which version you are using. Yeah, it's very convenient. Users can exit this program here and then click power off and exit the whole program. That's it. So you have a quick video view of the features included in the DFL SRP for WD firmware repair too. So this one is one USB 3 Western Digital Hard Drive firmware repair, repair too. So if you are interested in this too, you can contact us by sales at dolphindatalab.com or you can add our Skype account dolphin.data.net. Thank you for watching this video.